Hello boys and girls, welcome to day three of your writing lesson. You will be continuing working on your debate, should animals be kept in zoos? Your learning goal, students can develop an engaging opinion essay with supporting facts and details to support their opinion. Your success criteria, I can successfully write a five paragraph opinion essay with an introduction, supporting details, and a conclusion. Again, your question this week on the debate, should animals be kept in a zoo? Your writing paper this week began with your introductory paragraph. So you have your introduction, which has your thesis statement in it and your hook. And that's where you write a sentence that clearly states your opinion on the topic. So today what you're going to do is you are going to begin paragraph two. Well, this is the part you've already started. So the three reasons should be listed in either the yes or no column on page 23 that you did in um, over here. So whatever the three reasons that you wrote on either side, this is what will be going in this paragraph here. So the first reason would be your topic reason, stating your reason, and then now you just need to support that with sentences that are evidence from the article. Okay, and then that becomes paragraph two. So when you look over here, and if you were on the no side or the yes side, whichever side you're on, it, whatever reason you wrote for number two, that is going to go in as your topic sentence for number three. And then from the article, you'll have to find and pull evidence, text evidence to support your reason, okay? So, and then you'll do the exact same thing for paragraph four. So when you put this in Schoology, you need to either indent or skip a line to show the separation of your paragraphs, okay? And these are not just one sentences. You have your topic sentence, and then you have sentences that are your text evidence. Topic sentence and sentences that are your evidence. That's why these say paragraphs, okay? So make sure that you are writing paragraphs here. So on this assignment in Schoology, you should have three different paragraphs here for this assignment, okay? So in conclusion, an opinion essay includes supporting facts and details to support your opinion. It includes a plan with details from both sides and a thesis statement. An opinion essay includes research with facts and details. It also includes an introduction, supporting paragraphs, and a conclusion. I hope that you have enjoyed writing on this topic, and if you have any questions at all, reach out to your teachers.